Hi guys, I can actually hear music playing hopefully because actually now you have to pay for everything on your editor, everything on your editor, background noise, you know you have to pay for it. So hopefully I can chat above this music. We're on Tuesday the 24th of September, lovely day, good afternoon everyone, I can hear the can learn. I keep, it sounds like thunder, it's the Canlahan Volcano. Right, some strange lights going off here. So the Canlahan, she's still on, as far as I know, she's on. still on a warning. And they're still having big trouble with the Canlahan Volcano. Now, I can't get on Facebook. Wow, Ooh. I'm going to try and reverse this camera in a minute. We're going to get a storm, I can actually see all the folk, wow. So, while I'm actually chatting, I'll just reverse the camera. And hopefully you can see that lightning. Let me make sure I'm not standing on some of what bites. Out there, so, see? Right, I'll actually stand this way. I know it's a little bit dark and you can't see me. So let me try and turn round. Right, I'll actually reverse the camera. Hopefully you got that fork lightning. So we're going to get a really bad storm. Which is quite nice because it's been very, very hot here in the province. And I've just said, wow, that looks absolutely spectacular. Fork lightning over there. Let me see if I can actually turn round. And then you can see the fork lightning. And you, hopefully, wait a moment. I'm just going to try and find somewhere where you can actually see this fork lightning. It's absolutely spectacular. Out there, right. Let's have a look. Right, you're not going to see it, are you? You're not going to see me chatting. Right, so I'm going to, I'll reverse the camera and hopefully we can catch some of this fork lightning. Right, so I haven't really been able to get back onto Facebook. Why? I mean, I'm on YouTube at least, what, three times a week. You know, I've started to upload a few videos. But, you know, cost still living here in the Philippines. I'm not going to start, I can feel rain now coming. Right, then the wind's here, so we're getting a storm. So it's just a little chat. Facebook, can't get on Facebook. Don't know why, so I've decided to change my sim. And Jovelin went for a sim yesterday to into Mercia and she went into UV and she says wow that sim that sim card because this sim card now on this phone it's not registered. It looks like someone's in the cornfield. So it's not registered. So I'm actually I've actually been out and we bought a sim card. But I can't put the sim card in till Dorbeline's niece actually changes it tomorrow. Wow, this fork lightning's absolutely spectacular. I'm gonna have to try and turn this phone round. Hopefully you might catch a little bit of fork lightning while we're chatting, cause the storm's coming. Like I said, we need this storm. And I thought I'd come out and do a chat. And then what happens when I come out to do a chat, it gets very windy and the rain's coming right which we need so when I first came to the Philippines for this phone it costs for any phone it costs about 30 pesos for a sim card so that was 30, 30 pesos for a sim card now this sim card we've just bought 70 pesos and then Jovelin said to Anish yesterday wow Paul's sim cards just cost me 70 pesos and when he first came to the Philippines it were only 30 how much did that new sim card cost how much was the last sim card that you bought what was the cost so and he said 40 they were either 40 or 50 but now it's it's gone up to 70 so you know things are getting a little bit expensive here in the Philippines and I thought wow that's just shot up big style because it's quite a jump 
poppy colour here in the Philippines. <laughs> right, so like I said, I came out for a, a little chat. Don't know if you've got any of that fort lightning, hopefully we'll get some in later. Like I said, the can land, she's rattling, she's rattling away. We've got all this beautiful fort lightning here. And it looks like it's over there. Let me think, look, look a little that way. It's more or less over in Tobacco Lodge City, coming round in Tandem Annum. Wow, look at the, all that sky is actually flashing away. And it's only about half past two in the afternoon. So, you know, things here in the Philippines are getting quite expensive. And that was the same, actually, with, when you come out here to build a house. So when you actually do come out here now to build a house, it's going to get quite expensive. Right, because it's, it's getting really so windy and we've got a storm coming, I'm actually going to walk back to the house. Right, but that's the rice field, the rice is coming on very, very nicely. And like I said, we've got quite a lot of nice fork lightning going off. Right, so just to let you know, you know, I can't get on Facebook. The reason I can't get on Facebook is because my SIM card's not actually registered. And every time I actually come into this wood, right, this little mango forest, as we're chatting, I've got mosquitoes biting my legs. And it's really bad for mosquitoes in here. And you, you can't feel them and you can't see them till they start itching. So, looks like we're going to get a lovely storm. So I'll catch you. I catch some of this storm and hopefully like I said we've still got the lightning coming across and I get you a little bit of this lightning so 70 pesos now for a sim card can't get on Facebook every day you know I normally use free data on Facebook because I ain't got the money right to buy data so I use free data and every and I, since last week cannot I, well it's about two weeks now knocking on about two weeks I cannot get on Facebook because I've got no free data and my SIM card is not registered so I'm, I'm tipping it's just down to it's either Facebook or it's my SIM card I'll find out when I change the SIM card and the only other way to get back onto Facebook is I just need to put a load on Facebook which I probably won't be able to do that because I can't, I ain't got the budget. So I, when I get back to Facebook, you know, it'll just be, it'll just be when I, when I can get on Facebook and when I can actually upload a few short videos onto Facebook and it's as simple as that really. So like I said, looks like we've got a storm coming. We really need this rain, that's for sure. So it'll be really nice, it's nice and cool now. Yesterday was red hot and this, about half an hour, uh, half an hour ago, really, really too hot here. Very, very, very hot here, crazy hot. So things here in the Philippines, quite expensive. I'm not gonna start chatting about price of rice and price of food. You know, everyone seems to do that one. So I'm not, I'm not gonna chat about that. But important things, you know, like load, you know, it's going to be going up. I'm wondering what that is flying across. So it's going to be actually going up. And SIM cards, you know, they've shot up. You know, building materials shooting up. So things here in the Philippines, you know, a, a, lot, of, a lot of people here in the Philippines... They don't realise inflation, guys, right? So to you Filipinas, you just don't understand inflation. So I'll try and... I don't know what I've done to my arm, but that's really aching. I think I've banged it on wall. So I think I've got it one of those on wall. I don't know what I... I don't know, passing an helmet through window, I think. So... Inflation. Right. You've got a million pesos, which is a nice little bit of money. So today you have a million pesos, right? So let me have a look. So this house, right, it costs a million pesos. And you have a million pesos in your bank. 
So you've got a million pesos in, in the bank and this million pesos is in your bank 2024, which is a bad year for me. So 2024, 2024, today you've got 1 million pesos in the bank. Now this house here costs 1 million pesos. Right, so in 10 years time, this house now, what cost a, a million pesos in 2024, in 10 years time, it's now 2 million pesos. So your million pesos that's in the bank is now, instead of going up, it's gone down. It's called inflation. In other words, cost of living, things are going up and up and up. So things are going up, right? But what a lot of people don't realise here in the Philippines, your money's going down. So your one million pesos in 2024, right? You can see someone at the back of me. And so your million pesos in 2024, now in 10 years time, it's only worth half a million, right? Really, it's only worth half a million. In other words, you're getting so little profit, you know, things are getting more expensive. Either you pay your wages, you pay, you know, either you pay, you're even lower paid because of inflation, right? In other words, You've got your million pesos now in the bank in 10 years time you can't buy this house you cannot buy that house for a million it's now two million see your money's going down it's called inflation i hope you understand that i tried to explain it hopefully i tried to explain it to some of you guys that don't know so hopefully i can actually get back onto youtube and I can actually get back onto Facebook, right? It's the mascara next month, guys. September, October. Next month is the mascara. So I got the mascara here in Back College City. If I've got a budget, I'll be there and I'll do a video. So hopefully I can. I missed it last year. Got there the year before, but I missed it last year. Didn't have a budget. No petrol to get into Bacolod, which is only about 12 kilometres away. So I didn't have petrol to get there. So hopefully, you know, we can get to Bacolod City. So I hope everyone's fine and taking care. So that's it, really. We've got a storm coming. We need this storm. We need this water. Right, one of my tomato plants has collapsed and it looks like there's no flower on it. And it's either because I haven't watered it, because we've had no rain. So now I'm going to go and have a look at it and try and sort it out. So that's it. We need a lovely bit of rain, but I don't know if I'm going to get into Mercia tomorrow. Like I said, it's Tuesday today. Uh, 24th, I think. So might be Wednesday or Thursday before I actually get back into Mercia. going to do a video when I get to Mercia. Pure Gold is opening on Thursday, so tomorrow, Wednesday, I'll actually try and get into back into Mercia, because I want to do a video on Pure Gold, which I've probably done about four or five of them anyway. So you have to go and watch the previous videos. That's the Canlahan Volcano, she's in the clouds. So she's in the clouds. And like I said, we're not... We're not we are actually not forced to get any rain whatsoever. Even though it's thundering and lightning, the can line, I can hear her rumbling away, and she's probably on, still on alert. But, you know, simple as that, really, guys. So, I not woke up there because I can hear music. So, hopefully I can get to mercy here. But like I said, things here in the Philippines are getting quite expensive. And... Um, I'll be happy to get back to England sooner or later. Yeah, the feeling, you get you get back to England, you want to be back here in the Philippines, but there's a lot, a lot of things I need to be doing when I actually get back into England. Blogging for one, a lot of places I want to visit in England. Yeah, it's going to be very difficult, but it's as simple as that, we'll make it happen. 
but it'd be very difficult and it's a lot better to walk around in the in England right so like I said mascara next month hopefully I can actually get back into this phone's not exactly fantastic anymore it's on its way out so hopefully I can actually get into Mercia Thursday and do a video on pure gold pure gold it's a shopping centre guys so I just do a little video on pure gold because it's opening a lot of pure gold a lot of the shops around it in it have already opened so that's what I'll actually do so hopefully I can actually get back onto Facebook and because what happens is I've just got no connection whatsoever trying to get on FB right so hopefully get this sim card in and it'll change things because it's registered and hopefully I can actually well we'll see what happens so that's it look that's it beautiful but nowhere to walk right so I will actually be happy to get back to England how am I going to get back to England God knows we'll cross that bridge when it comes to it thanks for all the great comments guys you know take care God bless Merry Christmas yep the Philippines is one of the probably one of the places in in the world one of the first places in the world that celebrate Christmas first and last the longest so it's a really long celebration Christmas here guys so the guys here in the Philippines start to celebrate Christmas very very early and even after Christmas past the new year they really do st still like to hang on to Christmas and they like to celebrate it right and that's really strange you've got a poor country you know you've got a country what's fairly poor yeah we know it's quite rich but it's poor in a lot of places but they like to celebrate and people in England have got all this money and um, in England we don't really celebrate do we to be honest we've got all these big parks you know we've got all this land no it goes off anymore does it you know there's no galas every week you'd be lucky to get a gala in England once a year a party in the park you know it used to be every week when we were kids it's all gone right so god knows what's happening in england i'm sure we'll find out right ride safe take care god bless right what happened yesterday coming home about eight o'clock and there's a lot of people that's drunk drink driving here come down to the junction i saw this saw this car this whatever it was a car a van a lorry so I had to pull, instead of pulling to the white line to go, you know, to pull over. So I had to pull really over, then another car came onto my side of the road, and I was hanging back, and it came onto my side of the road, so I had to pull right, right over, doing about two kilometres an hour, let him pass. And I thought, drink driver, so it's weekend, when the weekend's coming, you know, like I said, ride safe, take care, God bless. Right, we're going back to the house. So have a lovely day, take care. Hopefully we'll get to mercy. And I can get this SIM card sorted out. Take care, God bless. Here in Concilian, please like, please subscribe, please share the video. Support in the way of a dollar.
actually see all my flowers most of the flowers have actually been snapped so they've all fallen over but I've got plenty of seeds so all these flowers the wind's actually taking them all over but you can see look like I said I've got loads of seed on so I've still got loads of seed still got a lot of seed and what I'll do is I'll just throw them out just throw them all over the place and they actually sell seed so you know a week or two when these are finished because the butterflies are still on these I'll actually take them out don't know what these two are doing looks like they're looking for food put it down she'll go and chew that bottle up now she's gone in she's gone in because she thinks she's going to get some food right so I don't know what's happened to this tomato plant definitely needs water and it's not looking fantastic but I'm actually going to stake it up so I'm actually going to stake it up in a minute so I don't know what's happened to it it was okay yesterday probably no water but that one's still looking healthy but you don't know if insects have got into this plant or what so I'm not really sure so that's it guys we are waiting for the rain the storm to come right take care god bless have a great day so this is the house house for sale So that's the house, that's the bike, right, great day, and it's enough to water the plants, so not so bad, three or four minutes rain, like I said, it's enough to water the plants, so it's always welcome, a lovely bit of rain. So that's about it guys, nice bit of terrain, please like, please subscribe, please help support in the way of a dollar. <laughs>